but we do have Chuck Hage here again to sing for us. So I'm so happy. Thank you, Chuck, for being with us again. Um, so we will have him. And then right before Ruslan, Dr. Ruslan Slutsky's presentation at 2.15, I'm going to do a couple door prizes. Ready? Go ahead whenever you're ready, sir. All right. Well, this is your brain break. And I must say, uh, you've been working hard. It's excellent. Um, this song, we're going to do a little song here that requires no thinking on your part. Everybody's been open-minded about multiculturalism and ethnicity and ability, uh, but there's one kind of person that gets left out, and this song is about him. Hey, everybody, wherever you are, there's a new way of talking, and it's going to go far. You take the letters in the words, and you turn them all around, say the last ones first, check out the sound, talk backwards. Talk backwards. I know what you're thinking, that it sounds strange. You talked forward so long that it's hard to change, but it's just like metric once you catch the drift. You twist your tongue, give your palate a lift, take your favorite phrase and turn, read it in the mirror. Practice that about a half a year, then straw cap, can he clap me up to cool? You're a regular talking bass backwards fool. Talk backwards. Talk backwards. The other day I was walking down the street and I saw someone I thought I'd like to meet. I said, excuse me, miss, sir, to take away to roost, rat, see, kill you, rah, teet, ruoy, tub, tiggy, not two o taunts to met. And I said, am I getting through to you yet? She said, I love it when you talk backward to me. You talk backward. Talk backward. You never know, but one of these nights, those who talk backwards will demand their rights. They'll rise up angry and get a solution in the form of an amendment to the Constitution. Then every TV show that airs will have to be captioned for the forward impaired. Talk backwards. Talk backwards. Talk backwards. Da -da 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 -da. That's a great song by the late, great Steve Goodman. And I heard you say something about door prizes, but I have a special trivia quiz for you. What other Grammy award-winning song did the same author write, Steve Goodman? And when you get your answer, I want you to write it on the back of a $20 bill and mail it to me at my house and we'll send you your prize. All right, well, during the course of a day like this, you might be wondering, why am I working with young children? What brings me to this life? And you may not know it, but there was a long, long survey that was taken. And we do have, happen to have here, the results of the survey. It's a top 10 list. Why we've chosen to work in the early childhood profession. I'd like to share that, the results of the survey with you. Are you ready? We'll start with 10. Number 10, it's great fun while we're waiting to win the lottery. Excellent reason. All right, number nine, the number nine reason we're working with young children, because working in an early childhood setting helps us truly understand the meaning of phrases like a natural disaster and an act of God. Number eight. We can't sing worth beans, but the children still love us. Number seven, we love snot. It's true, correct? You chase those kids around, you got plenty of tissues in every pocket. Number six, we love hugs and kisses. We actually have seen preschool teachers wearing shirts saying, we'll work for hugs. And you know that's true when you look at your paycheck. Well, it's just the way it is right now. Gonna get better. Number five reason that we work with young children, ants on a log, the best. Four reason, number four reason, we work with young children, we still giggle at burps and farts. Number three, 
Trying to keep up with kids is better than high impact aerobics. Keeps you going, keeps you fit. Number two, second reason that we work with young children because young children think we're the greatest. And the number one reason in the survey that we work with young children, we love those little chairs. Get ready for the staff meeting, love those chairs. All right, so I'm gonna wrap it up with a great song by Tom Hunter and sung by Tom Hunter and Bev Boss. Back in the day, it's called Together Hand in Hand. We're all in this together. And everybody in the classroom, social workers, in administration, everybody works together. And when we do that, everybody benefits. This song is called Together Hand in Hand. By ourselves, we're good. But together we're better, together we're much better hand in hand. By ourselves we sing, but together we sing better, together we sing better hand in hand. Oh big hands, little hands, waving hands and clapping hands, all different kinds of hands together hand in hand. Ourselves we play, but together we play better. Together we play better hand in hand. By ourselves we work, but together we work better. Together we work better hand in hand. Smooth hands, rough hands, tired hands, and holding hands, all different kinds. Together we cry better, together we cry better hand in hand. By ourselves we laugh, but together we laugh better, together we laugh better hand in hand. Oh, talking hands, mighty hands, quiet hands and reaching hands, all different kinds of hands together hand in hand. There are big hands, little hands, waving hands and clapping hands, all different kinds of hands together, hand in hand. We're all working together. Let's keep up the good work, you guys. Enjoy the rest of your brain break if you need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Thank you so much, Chuck. We really appreciate it. That's awesome brain break to take us into our afternoon session. All right. Well, thank you very much. You take care. You too. All right.